Hello, my name is Abigail Plunkett and I'm a 12th grade ambassador, Gold Award Girl Scout from San Jacinto Council. I'm here to help you with tips and suggestions to continue with your Gold Award despite the impact of COVID-19. Something that helped me so much with my project was making lists. I had notepads full of stuff and sticky notes stuck all over my desk and laptop. So using notepads to write down details and bright and fun sticky notes to write down quick tasks are very helpful. Hey future Gold Award Girl Scouts, my name is Jalen and I'm here to help you in the implementation part of your project. I understand that this is a very sensitive time and it's really hard for you to really go out and implement, but here are some tips and tricks that you can do to help make your project as fun and stress-free as possible. So, for organization, I definitely recommend that you keep a binder. So this is mine. I know it's kind of big, but keep in mind I have finished my goal work, so I have literally everything in here. But some things that I recommend that you keep in your binder are letters and documents that you receive pertaining to anything in your project, your gold award checklist so you can make sure throughout your um, project that you're covering everything that you said you were and if you have to make changes, you can. I would also keep a list of people that you have contacted throughout this event and who you've contacted, when you contacted them, and approximately how long you talked to them for just so you can be sure to put that in your hours log. I recommend keeping it in like a separate document, so maybe a Word document, whatever program you use, Excel, and then kind of transition it over to the Google Online application. And then I also that recommend you keep that in your binder. Hi, my name is Kiana Gill, and I'm from Girl Scouts of San Jacinto Council. So, while you're at home um, and getting the things rolling, uh, as you work on your gold award from the safety of your own house, there may be a couple of points where you're wondering, I have all of this information, how do I keep it organized? How can I make sure that in the future I can find things when it really matters when I'm starting to turn things into Girl Scouts? So, here's some organization tips, tricks, everything in between. So, number one, and I would say this is probably the most important thing on this entire list, is keep everything in one place. Uh, whether it be on Google Drive, or in your emails, or in your computer, don't be afraid of creating folders and folders and folders. It makes life so much easier if you can find everything when you have to turn it in. Um, the next thing is use Gold Gold. Gold Gold is an amazing, wonderful resource, and life goes a lot smoother if you are working through your project and working on the information you have to fill out for Gold Gold at the same time. So I can't stress this enough, use Go Gold, it's great. Um, keep track of your hours. While you're working on your project, it's easy to forget that hours are a really big requirement. You have to have at least 80 hours to get your goal to work. So try to keep track of your hours and along that same line, keep track of your expenses. You have to turn in how much money you've spent and where you got your money from um, throughout the project. So keep track of both of those things so that way you don't have to worry at the very end where did my hours come from? Who's doing what? So this kind of goes along with project management, but remember to write down who's doing what so that way you don't lose track of what's being done and who you have to assign things to. That way you don't end up with things that aren't done or two people assigned to the same thing. Uh, the next thing is plan, but don't over plan. Uh, planning is really great. Uh, planning and organization go hand in hand and it's great to be really organized but if you plan too much, you might end up really stuck in the same mindset and it doesn't allow you to adapt and change as your project changes. Uh, some kind of key tools that I like to use with my project is Trello. Trello is a really great project management tool. It allows you to make lists and then archive items as you finish them. And then Excel and Google Sheets are fantastic. Do not be afraid of Excel and Google Sheets. They are great, wonderful tools. Um, if you don't already know how, make sure you guys know how to freeze a row or a column so that way when you scroll, the row and the column stay there and you can see kind of how everything lines up in total. And then sum. Sum is something I used a lot uh, when I was adding up all my hours, so I didn't actually have to do my math, the math itself. Uh, Google Sheets did it for me. I just highlighted all my boxes and it added it together. So, yeah, that's all I have to say about organization. Good luck on your gold award and stay home and stay healthy.